Hey friends, it is grocery haul day and I have a regular grocery store haul as well as a Costco haul for you. So without further ado, let's get into it. Okay, so starting off with the grocery stuff, I've got two boxes of chicken broth. I have used up all of my homemade stock. I'm going to be making some homemade tomato soup uh, to go in the freezer with a lot of my tomatoes that I grew in my garden. And I used up all my stocks, so I needed to get some. I got two water enhancers, tangerine grapefruit, for both flavors. They only had two available, so I was really kind of bummed, um, but that's all right. I got uh, some sugar for baking. This is actually a free item, um, the Simply Orange 100% Pure Natural Orange Juice. Um, we got some quick whole grain oats, some raisins, Frank's Red Hot Sauce, I have been craving a buffalo chicken salad like you would not believe. Um, two cans of pumpkin, the big cans, because it is time for all the pumpkin yumminess to come out. Um, I got a pack of turkey sausage, and I got two big club packs of lean, extra lean ground beef. Um, these were on for around $13 each. These were between $9 and $10 off, so I ended up getting two packs because, I mean, basically I'm getting two for the price of one. Um, and I'm planning to do some freezer cooking and I'm gonna do a lot of meatballs with this because meatballs are really a protein that my whole family loves and they're easy and I can cook them from frozen. I got um, a bag of carrots, a bag of apples, two cauliflower, these were on for $1.48. And what I love to do, I've said it a thousand times, but I prep this, I either rice it or I, um, I blanch, cook, like cook it, blanch it, uh, for just a few minutes and freeze it because I find that buying a cauliflower is a whole lot cheaper for me than buying frozen cauliflower. And cauliflower is a big part of our diet around here. Um, one avocado, one lemon, some ham deli meat, some salami deli meat, garlic, mushrooms, some lettuce. Um, I want to call, <laughs> I almost called these sweet potatoes, but we all know that these are actually strawberries. Um, some dill and two things of flour. Um, and uh, this pizza yeast. So I love to make my own homemade pizza dough. And that's another thing that I'm going to do this week is we're going to have homemade pizza, but I'm going to also make dough to stick just right in the freezer to have for later. And I love this pizza yeast. I find it makes a difference with the crust and I love it. So I got a pack of that. And lastly, I got some good old Zevia. Some people say Zevia. Maybe it's Zevia. I don't know. I call it Zevia, but the cola flavor excuse me, is my favorite. So that, oh, that is it for the food portion. I did get a couple um, non-food items and I'll show you those in a second. Okay, excuse the fan on the uh, stove. It is 81 degrees in my house, it is hot. Okay, so I got this uh, Tresme conditioner. I absolutely love this stuff. It makes my hair feel so good. I haven't had it in a very long time. Um, and I am a huge fan of this Tresemme um, hairspray. It is my ride or die. I use this thing every day. And lastly, I got a bottle of this Lysol. It's the hydrogen peroxide one. So we just got a new puppy. She is 12 weeks old. Um, she's a Labrador retriever. She's so sweet and cute. But, you know, puppies make masses, so we have just been using this, you know, after she, if she has an accident in the house, thankfully it's just been pee accidents, but, you know. So, um, I just got that to help clean up that. Okay, so let's talk Costco. Um, so my husband is home for the next couple days. He's home visiting. He's away working, like, eight hours away. So some of these things were things that he picked up, like the chocolate milk. My kids were really excited about that. Um, so the chocolate milk, um, we got mangoes, frozen mangoes. I'm immediately gonna put some of these in the fridge. I love to thaw them out and just have them for a fruit. Provolone cheese. I got some cream, um, just regular cream for coffee. Um, whipped cream, so this is like the 35% cream. Um, this is gonna go in my tomato soup. 
I also got this Starbucks um, cold brew coffee. This was $10 for both of these things. Um, my sister-in-law brought this to camp and it was so good. I do not drink much coffee anymore at all. It's only when I'm really, really dragging, but sometimes I want a cold coffee and I just decided I needed this iced coffee in my life. Um, and I'm excited to have that. So this was another purchase for my hubby, but I was pretty excited about it. It is a moose tracks ice cream. Yum. It's like peanut butter cups and moose tracks fudge with uh, in vanilla ice cream. So good. We got a big thing of marble cheese and a big thing of uh, pizza mozzarella. So this will be for our homemade pizzas. We got some uh, Greek yogurt, our favorite avocado oil. We also picked up steaks. So this is the top sirloin um, grilling steak, cap removed. So yeah, we got steaks and um, some free run eggs. So I think I mentioned in my last grocery haul that I would love to just find a farmer and buy eggs straight from the farmer. I haven't yet. Um, so my next best option is to get free run eggs from the grocery store. And I was finding that I was paying around $6 for a pack of eggs at the grocery store. And this is $6 at Costco for two packs. I find a difference in the egg yolk, like it's so dark orangey yellow. That's when you know an egg is really good. Um, and they are just wonderful. I eat eggs all the time, so it's important to me to have a more quality egg. Um, I got two bags of the Silver Hills Organic Sprouted um, Bread. So I love sprouted bread. It's pretty much my favorite. I like to make my own bread too, but I gotta be honest, in this pregnancy, I'm just like, no. I'm going for a little bit more convenience um, with some of my choices and just buying bread is a lot easier. I also picked up, this was another impulse buy, but this was, um, this was a sample and it's these cheddar cheese potato chips. Now, I have been craving cheddar cheese potato chips. Lay's makes sour cream and cheddar chips. They're not the same as the same chip that I grew up with. They are very different and maybe it's just because they're in Canada and they just, they're not great. But I tasted these and these were amazing. They were crispy and they had like thinner ridges and the cheese flavor was on point. So I got a big bag. <laughs> I also got some um, diced peach fruit cups for the kiddos, um, chocolate chips. And then another thing is paper towels. We had gone without paper towels for a long time, but with the puppy, it just makes more sense to have paper towels. So we got some paper towels for puppy messes. And that is my Costco haul. I was wrong. There were a couple more things that we picked up from Costco. We also got um, a big pack of AA batteries. This is, you get 48 and these are around $12. These last me forever, but with the holidays coming up and twinkle lights and all the toys and things, double A's for sure. Um, I also picked up my son these dinosaur sheets. Um, he is going to be moving into a big boy bed soon. He's just in like the convertible uh, crib where it's like the toddler bed. So he's going to be moving into a twin bed in the next couple months here. And we got him um, a comforter and these little dinosaur sheets he's going to love because he is a huge dinosaur fan. And then we also got him um, this footy sleeper. This is from Carter's, um, Carter's for Costco. And it has the sweetest little print. I told him, I said, I can't wait to cuddle you in this. So... 81 degrees here today. This is not going to be wearing this tonight. I can, I can promise you that.